Hey, me, Matt here. So, I just finished Raw, and pretty impressive, actually. You know, a lot of what I've seen recently, like I just watched NXT, I think last night, which I didn't think I was going to get here, but it is on Sportsnet 360, so it was actually pretty cool. Obviously, I mentioned that Killer Cross is a part of the WWE roster. Also, forgot to mention, Phantasma makes his WWE return debut, and it's really cool to see what's going to happen in the near future. Now, there was a lot of controversy about what happened last night with Nia Jax, who returned a few weeks ago, actually, and yeah, there is a lot of bullshit about where she is the most dangerous person in the ring you know it is what it is you know like Jim Ross had said it's not ballet it's fucking wrestling that's the way it should be and it's just kind of like okay so she had a match with uh, Kyrie Sane and Kyrie kind of hit her head on the bottom turnbuckle could have been fatal or serious, but just kind of like weird because it's not the first time Night Jax has been deemed as being dangerous. So I'm not sure what they're going to do with that, but Raw was pretty good. You know, you had the Viking Raiders do like a karaoke carpool thing, Hanson and Raw basically doing. I don't know what the hell that was, but you had Hanson with a chicken wing, or a drumstick, so, okay. It, you know, Drew McIntyre, who faced Angel Garza, I really like the stable with Garza, Andrade, and Austin Ferry with the Selena Vega, and so that's pretty cool. I like these ideas that are going around with Money in the Bank as well. I think that them starting on a ground level and going up to the top was, A, terrifying. And, you know, well, me being afraid of heights anyways, but it's going to be interesting to see how that works. And just because this thing is going on right now in the world doesn't mean you can't be creative. But, there it is. Now, I didn't watch, or haven't watched, Impact in a long time since I got back. But, when I go back to my apartment, it'll be interesting to see how Impact was. Dynamite, same thing. Very fucking cool. I really enjoyed the... FaceTime interaction with the inner circle and of course fucking Jericho are doing I look like an impression of the Aussie interview from Western civilization of I can't remember what it was you know, the movie back in the 90s but or 80s I guess well, anyways it doesn't matter it's going to be interesting to see what happens on Money in a Bank. I don't know if I'll do a review from that. Or a prediction show, rather. It'll be interesting to see if Killer Kyle does a prediction video. But... It'll be... Interesting in a few weeks to come. And... Yeah, you know what? I can't wait to do Wheels of Fury once again when this is all over and enjoy my time here in the country so it'll be interesting I've said that a lot in this video but yeah it will be and I guess Smackdown is I think 23 years that Triple H or Paul Levesque has been in WWE slash WWF so that's pretty cool. Anyways, yeah. 
And that'll be it from me, I guess. So, talk to you later. Bye.